Hello, my name is Olivia Young. I'm the founder of Box and Flow. I'm here with Myra. Today, we are going to take you through a flow fundamental so that you can use these tools to take our full box and flow class. We are going to start on the mat, on our back, with our feet together and our hips apart. One hand on your heart, one hand on your belly. Just get grounded, get centered. Maybe close your eyes, take a big breath, inhale. Exhale out your mouth. Ah. One more breath, inhale. Exhale, let it go. Knees to your chest, hug in tight. Rock up and down your spine. Find your way to your tabletop pose. So your hands are right under your shoulders. Your fingers are spread wide. On your inhale, you're gonna arch your spine. You're gonna look up. On your exhale, you're gonna round belly in, squeeze. Exhale, inhale, up, dog, up. Exhale, round. Last one, big breath, inhale. Exhale out your mouth, ha. Ah. Press down. Pick your hips up and back, downward facing dog. So your feet are in line with your hips. Your fingers are spread wide. Your shoulders are down your back. Your shoulder blades are hugging together. Your belly is to your spine and you're pressing back as you ground down. You're gonna shake your head out. You're gonna feel all the pressure down into the mat and then up back like somebody is pulling you from your hips, but you're not gonna pull off the mat because you're grounded in your hands. Your next inhale, you're gonna forward, roll forward to high plank. Notice my shoulders are now right over my wrists. My belly is in tight. I'm pressing back in my heels, which engages my thighs. This is your high plank. Your shoulder blades are coming together. I'm gonna roll my weight forward to the tips of my toes. I'm gonna bend my elbows right down halfway 90 degrees. On my inhale, I'm gonna flip my feet. I'm gonna press up, up dog. On my exhale, I'm gonna pull up and back from my belly all the way to my downward facing dog home base. This is your flow. Again, you're gonna inhale, roll forward, high plank. Everything engaged. You're gonna exhale, you're gonna lower halfway, low push up. On your inhale, flip your feet, up dog, open your chest. On your exhale, downward facing dog, up and back. One more time, inhale, forward plank. Your exhale, you lower halfway. Your up dog, you press high. Your down dog, you fill up and back. You're gonna separate, jump to the front of your mat. Halfway lift, flat back, belly in, bow down, fold. On your inhale, you're gonna rise up from your feet, lifting all the way high, taking up space. Hands to your heart, close your eyes. Just reset that intention, get really grounded, get really tall. Your next inhale brings you all the way up, stretch. Exhale, you bow down, fold, let it go. Your halfway lift, you inhale. Hands down, high plank pose. Exhale to lower, low push up. Your inhale, up dog flip. Your exhale, downward facing dog up and back. Right side, warrior one. Your right leg extends back. Your foot is flexed like you're standing on the ceiling. Now round your spine, hug your knee to your nose, squeeze. Step your foot through. Your front foot is at a 90 degree bend. Your back heel is down. Notice Myra's back heel is down. She's lifting up and out of her waist. Spread your fingers high, lift up and back. Hands down, high plank. Exhale to lower. Up dog, lift high. Down dog, up and back. Your left leg lifts, stretch. Exhale, knee to nose, round. Step through, warrior one. Left side. My left knee is bent at a 90 degree angle. My back foot is down. I'm lifting up and out of my waist. My pelvis is tucked. My heart is open. My shoulders are up and back. Big breath, inhale. Exhale, hands down, let it go. Up dog, breathe in. Down dog, breathe out, home base, stay. One more time, right side, warrior one. Step through, all the way up, inhale to rise. Big breath, inhale, 90 degree bend in that front knee. Hands down, let it go. Lower, up dog. Downward facing dog, left side lifts. Step it through, rise, grounding down. Back heel is down, lifting up and out. Hands down, flow, up dog, down dog, reset. You're gonna look to your hands. You're gonna step to the front of your mat. You're gonna flat back, halfway lift. You're gonna bat on, you're gonna fold. Inhale to rise all the way up, lifted. Exhale to bow, empty. Your hips go back, chair pose, like you're sitting into a chair. Big breath in, arms are back by your ears. 
Your pelvis is tucked, your thighs are squeezing in. You're hugging everything in. You have one big breath, sink low. Exhale, bow down, fold. Halfway lift, hands down high, plank pose, your flow. Exhale to lower, up dog, breathe in. Down dog, up and back. Right side lifts, inhale. Warrior one brings you all the way through. Lift up, up, up. On your exhale, you peel your hips open, warrior two. Notice Myra's front knee is bent 90 degrees. Her hips are open and she's staring right over her, her palm. So her focus is right ahead of her. She stays low in that front leg, reach up and back, reverse your warrior, stretch, side angle. Beautiful, so that hand comes down, your hips are open. One line from your bottom hand to your top palm. Looking up, maybe opening, big, big back bend, stay low in those legs. Your hand comes down, frame that foot, step back, high plank, exhale, lower. Up dog, inhale, down dog, up and back. Your left side, inhale, stretch. Step through to rise, reach high, warrior one. Big breath brings you up, exhale, peel open, warrior two, hips are square. Your focus is right ahead of you. Notice my front knee is bent, my back heel is down. I'm squeezing into my core, I'm reaching out from my wingspan, my shoulders up and down my back, I'm open. I'm staying low on my legs, big breath in, reverse that warrior. Exhale, side angle, left side. Your left hand is down, your right arm is up. My legs stay exactly where they are, my heart opens up to the sky. I'm peeling open, big, big breath, inhale. Exhale, let it go, hands down, lower. Up dog, downward facing dog, up and back. <sighs> We're gonna add on for one more move. Right side, warrior one, step through to rise. Inhale brings you up, exhale peels you open. You're gonna inhale, you're gonna reach back, reverse. You're gonna exhale, low lunge twist. Your left hand comes down, your right arm comes high, your back heel is up. So you're in a low runner's lunge, but you're twisted. Now try and ring out from your spine, open up, reach back behind you, big breath, inhale. Exhale, hands down, flow. Up dog, down dog. Left side, warrior one. Stepping all the way through to rise. Reach high, inhale. Exhale, peels you open. Reach back, reverse, big stretch. Low lunge twists, your right hand comes down. Your left arm comes all the way up. Your back heel is up. You're squeezing, rinsing from your low belly. Your back, your back leg is straight. You open, you open, big breath, inhale, stretch. Exhale, hands down, you flow. Up dog, downward facing dog, ha, home base. Pedal your feet out, shake your head out, more space in your back body. Breathing into your gut, inhale. Exhale, look at the top of your mat to your hands. I want you to step or jump to find your back. From here, you're gonna rock up and down and then limp in, land into your boat pose. So you're balancing on your tailbone, you're hugging your belly in, shoulders up and back, grab the backs of your thighs, get stability here. Now heart popping through those shoulders, that chest, maybe straighten your legs or maybe just reach up from where you are, up or out. You gotta take the risk here. If you fall, you fall, hold here. Now lower, flutter kick those feet. We're gonna go through some abs for two or three minutes in the real class. But for now, come back to sit. Big breath, inhale. Exhale. Find your back for one back bend. We're going into bridge or wheel. So you can either bend your knees, place them on the ground, interlace your hands under your low spine. Your palms are touching. You're gonna shimmy your shoulders under your low spine. You're gonna press your feet right into the ground. Your, your feet are parallel to your hips. You're gonna press up and out of your waist. Your hips are popping open. You're pressing down in your feet to lift your hips higher. Open up that chest. One more big breath, inhale. Exhale, let it go. If you're comfortable with that, you can take this into a full wheel. Your hands come behind your ears. You're gonna press up and out of your feet. Lifting all the way up. So your back is totally bent. You're pressing in your feet. Your hands are spread wide. You're lifting up from your chest. You're, you're grounding down to lift all the way up and out of your heart. Big breath, inhale. Exhale, let it go. 
feet together, knees apart. Hands to heart, hands to belly, reset, take another breath. From here, we're gonna come into half pigeon pose. So rock up and down your spine, come right through to half pigeon on the right side. Your front knee, your right knee is bent and in line with your hips. Your right shin is parallel to the front of the mat. Bring your hands back by your hips. Lift yourself up, so make space. From here, you take space, you bow your head. Your back leg is straight. You can tuck your toes or keep them flat on the ground, but you want to release everything down to the ground and find a little bit of stillness for a few breaths, just as Myra is doing. Not holding on, completely letting go. We're going to switch sides. Left side comes front, right leg in the back. Lifting up and out of your hips. Inhaling to make space. Exhaling to take space. From here, slowly peeling yourself up, both legs straight out in front of you. We're gonna take a forward fold, lifting up and out of your waist, big stretch. Exhale to bow. One vertebrae at a time, rolling all the way to find your back. All the way down. Last knee to nose, big hug and squeeze. Exhale, let it all go, release. Shavasana, surrender. You made it. Biggest challenge in this entire class is stillness at the end. So not forcing what's next or thinking about what you had to or didn't do. Let yourself completely get the benefits of all of the work you just worked through. We say flow through the fight, finding ease through resistance. You might notice that when you're in Shavasana, in surrender, the resistance is you fighting yourself to move forward, when actually all you have to do is just be here now. So one more big breath, inhale. Exhale. Thanks so much for joining us. Uh, this was Flow Fundamentals for our traditional Box and Flow class. Myra and I are so glad that you joined, and we hope that you'll take the full class soon.